Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Jenny and today I have a humongous Target clearance haul. Everything I picked up was 90% off and a lot of the stuff does not have to be for Valentine's. I, I am just, my mind is just like, what? I'm also going to include at the end here, I did scan um, a couple of items to show you what they were coming up at. I misplaced my paper on how many items I bought, but I think it was like 150 or 160. Um, but with tax, I paid $156.09. Um, retailed with tax was $1,523.15. That is a savings of $1,367.06 cents. Also, before I show you what I'm about to show you, if you scan an item and it comes up, item not found, do not go to an employee out on the floor to scan because they are supposed to take that and discard it or I can't remember what, what they're supposed to do, how they mark it. I can't remember the word the lady told me. Take it up to the register when you're about to pay. Because if they scan it and it comes up, that should be an item that's 90% off. Now, that is what I was told by an employee when I bought these items because a lot of it was coming up, item not found. So, just remember that. Okay, with all that said, I even have my receipts to show. I'm going to start off with these. No one knew about these. These were on an end cap, no sign, nowhere near the Valentine items. So I took one, scanned it, which I will show you in a, at the end, and what they came up by, I'm like, oh yeah. So yeah, I grabbed all of them. I have five kids, and yeah, my, and my dogs like them. These are the $25 pillows. And these are by Room Essentials. Now, I wrote down how many of the items I bought. So I bought three of this leopard print and these things are ginormous. So these were $2.50. Again, these were on an end cap. And another one that I found was down with all the regular pillows just mixed in. And that is this one. Now at Christmas time, I have a square one and my dogs love it. So I know they're gonna take these over. You guys, these things are huge and they are super soft. I was also able, oh, and how many did I buy of that one? I think I bought nine, I think nine of this one. And I bought two of the red and just one of this color, which is, uh, oh, it's so beautiful. For only $2.50, you guys. I can't get over it. I am mind blown. Okay, this this even tops it even more. Purses. These weren't with the clearance or anything. These, um, they had it in white, black, in this color. I picked up this color. These were $29.99 and they rung up for $2.99. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna show you right here. Both purses that I bought, right there. And the other one was $2.79, retail for $27.99. Again, this did not have any clearance sticker, was not with any of the clearance. You just need to know, okay, is it seasonal? Is it pink, red, have hearts on it? Anything to do with Valentine's, same with Christmas, anything with a Christmas tree, Christmas lights, blah, blah, blah. Scan it. And these were coming up on the scanner. So that was a huge score as well. And while I was in the back by the seasonal stuff, um, a worker there was bringing over a bunch of gift wrap and he was using the clearance gun thing. And he was marking these down to 39 cents for a roll of gift wrap. I bought five of this one. It can be for any holiday, for any reason whatsoever. And I bought two of this one, only because it was Valentine. Um, and this was 49 cents. And I bought just one of this one. And see, you wouldn't even 
think that this was Valentine's, right? But it came up 40 cents. 40 cents. Bam! I am set with wrapping paper. Okay, I don't even know where. Okay, let me move this. They even had Christmas stuff back there, you guys. Christmas stuff. And that stuff, especially that stuff, was not coming up. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to take it up to the register. I'm going to have her scan it. And they have to give it to you to the 90%. So I bought five of these. These are knit wraps. They were $5. So I paid 50 cents. I'm not going to unwrap this one. But it's like, you know, just like you can wear it as a scarf. You can wear it as a shawl. You can use it as a, a wrap around for like over your bathing suit or whatever. So yeah. 50 cents and I bought five of those. I bought one kit of this and I think it was 99 cents, I do believe. This is, um, it's hand cream and a file and it's like a nail kit set. So I bought one of those. This was 10 cents. This is a little lion squishy. So I bought one of those. I bought 11 packs of tissue paper 20 cents 20 cents for 12 sheets of tissue paper and then I bought 14 of this one and they were 20 cents yeah you can use those all year round I bought one pack of these these were 10 bucks so I paid one dollar for these makeup brushes yeah amazing and then this was 30 cents, retailed for three. This is a little hot pad. It has like rubber grip parts. And then you have the matching kitchen towel. 30 cents, you guys. I bought three of these. These are heavy duty. These were 30 cents. Now these were not coming up. These were saying item not found. Salvage. I think that's the word she used. But these are solid wood. Yeah. 30 cents. So I bought three of those. I bought three of these. These retail for six. So I paid 60 cents. 60 cents. <laughs> oh, these. I picked up three sets. One for my three older girls. These are mixing bowls. One dollar. And you get two of them. And these are heavy duty. One dollar just crazy. Um, I bought five packs of these slippers. They were 30 cents. I'm going to see if my daughter wants to give these to uh, her wedding party. So I grabbed those. Um, let's see these signs. These were only 60 cents. I bought five of these. Solid wood. You can always paint them and turn them into something else. I bought two of this one for 60 cents. And they even had a bunch of squishies for only, uh, what were they coming up? 50, 50 cents, so they retailed for $5. So I bought 17, and they had two different sets, but I just grabbed one to show you. So these are perfect for basket fillers, stocking stuffers, birthday gifts, whatever. Um, oh, some more tissue paper. I just bought one pack of that, and those were 20 cents. And then, no, 30 cents, and this one was 30 cents. Bought six packs of these treat bags. They were, I believe, 19 cents. And these bags were $2.50, so I paid 25 cents. I bought three packs. And these um, pox socket things you put on your phone, these were $5, so I got them for 50 cents. And I bought two of them. What are you barking at? My neighbor must be home. Um... Now, where are all these other goods? Okay, candles. I bought four of these. These retailed for $10, so I got them for a dollar. This jar is absolutely gorgeous. So, yeah, I'm going to see if my daughter wants those as well. Um, picked up a couple of these slimes. They came up uh, $0.59, cents, so they sold for $6. Isn't that insane? 
So I bought one red and one pink. I didn't, I didn't own a bunch of those. I bought four of these. These are the little um, chisel things. You get different stones, diamonds or whatever. My kids love doing these. Um, those were 50 cents, so they retailed for five. I bought two of these. These were, um, I believe, 50 cents slime. And then these were 30 cents, retail for three. They are a 30 count stamp set and this stamp set. And see, these weren't coming up either. Um, this cutting board, retail for $5. I bought four of them, so I paid 50 cents. These weren't ringing up either, but I got them for 50 cents because I had them up at the register. Because I've learned um, if you ask someone out on the floor and they'll say, oh, sorry, we can't sell that to you. And they'll take it and put it in a cart and put it in the back room. So don't ask an employee on the floor to scan it. You take it up to the register. Okay. Okay. So I bought 14 of these. These were only 10 cents. Um, I'll show you the different ones that I purchased. I think they were these three. So you get erasers and Valentine's. I just got it for the erasers for like little party favors and that. So like I said, they were only 10 cents. These were just so cute. You can use them for whatever. They are $1, so I paid one, no, 10 cents. You get eight cards and eight envelopes. If anything, you can just use the envelopes. So that one, that one, and that one. And like I said, I bought nine total, so I paid 90 cents for all those. These gift bags, these are so adorable. I bought nine all together, so I paid 90 cents. You get four per pack. So I have that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. You see, they were $1, so I paid 10 cents. These were up by um, the crafts in that on an end cap, not marked, no clearance sticker, but it was a heart. So I grabbed, um, grabbed one, scanned it, and sure enough, it came up 49 cents. Bought three of them. These are huge wooden hearts. Yeah. So don't think they're not, they're scattered throughout the store. Look at the gift wrap. Look at the cards. Look at the stationery. Go around the entire store. I bought two of each of these. Um, these were um, 35 cents. You get 20 stickers per box. So I went ahead and grabbed those. This teddy bear is so soft. It was $14.99 and it came up $1.49. This is made so well, super soft. This is gonna go to my niece for her baby boy. Look how cute that is. And they also had it in pink, $1.49. And look at this big mama. This was $24.99, so I paid $2.49 for this huge bear. Look at the difference. Huge. It's just crazy. Okay, moving on. Almost done. Some more heart pillows. Um, this was $14.99, so I paid $1.49 for that. Same with this, $1.49. And actually, this one's scented. I think. And then they had this one for $1.49. And this one was $1.49. Let me show you the tag so you know what I'm talking about. So there's that one. This one, she gave it didn't have a tag, but she gave it to me for a dollar. So yeah, got this big purple one for a dollar. And then this one was a dollar forty-nine. Amazing! Amazing! And then I grabbed, they had a lot of bags, but I just picked up a few so I have them. So if my kids just bought something for their boyfriend or if I buy something for my husband and I wanted a cute little bag, these were 29 cents, 39 cents, and 49 cents. So there's those. And that one, that one, and one big one. So that is everything that I bought at Target. It's just, I love this time of year after holidays, especially Christmas. Um, and the next one will be, they'll have a lot of stuff for Easter. 
So I don't even know what day Easter falls on. So I would say about a week or so after Chris or Easter, they're going to have 90% off. Now, I know a lot of you say that, you know, a lot of your stuff gets sold at 50%. But one of my targets, I should say, I went to three targets, by the way. Um, the last target I went to, they still had 50% off signs. There was no 70%, 90%. So people didn't know. So I'm like, yo, people. So I grabbed just one item. I scanned it and I said, sure enough, it's coming up 90% off. And all these people don't think it. I'm like, mm -mm. so I got whatever I wanted. And I was bam out of there. So I buried my receipts. Where are your receipts? So I wanted to show you guys. Oh, wait, I'm missing a speaker. I Oh, no, wait, oh my gosh, I'm not done. I still have this big old bag over here. Girl, you're losing it. As I was saying, I thought I bought more. Okay, look at this outfit for 99 cents. Look at that. Isn't that adorable? 99 cents. I bought two of these in two different sizes. These were 69 cents. And I just bought one of these. And this one was 99 cents. Look at that. I knew I had more stuff. How, oh, just losing it. Okay, these candles. Amazing. Perfect. I know my daughter's going to want to give these to the bridesmaids and that. These are adorable packaging. I bought six of this one and five of the red. They sold for $10. And these are by Opal House, which I love their candles. I paid $1. $1. So let me open one and I'm going to show you right there Look at that one dollar for this six ounce candle in this really cute velvet container. This a dollar, you guys, a dollar for a Bluetooth speaker. I bought five of them. I got four gray and one purple. See, and they weren't coming up. It said item not found. She gave it to me for a dollar. Yes, $1. I bought two of these. These retailed for five bucks and I paid 50 cents. How cute is this? Look at that. Put little goodies in there for a gift, I'm like working up a sweat. Oh, and this shirt I got for my niece for her baby. 89 cents. Look how cute that is. 89 cents. This was only a dollar, retailed for 10. Two coffee mugs says I love you I love you more does it have the price no it does not have the price but I did pay one dollar for that and I bought two sets by the way and I got these booties I just bought one pair they came up 59 cents look how cute those are those are gonna be cute for a doll baby um I bought some of this amazing putty this stuff is expensive it's like five dollars i think so i paid 50 cents so i bought two of whoo, the magnetic one and i bought one of the laser putty it does come with a laser and it does work um i bought two of the color changing and one of the blue electric i'm not sure exactly what that's going to look like and this, you build your own slime. I bought two of them. These are the two colors I picked up. Um, these were 50 cents, so they retailed for five. This one was 50 cents. I bought three of this one. This thing is huge of slime. Perfect birthday gifts for birthday parties. Just amazing. And then I bought one of this glitter one. Oh, and I bought three of the glow-in-the-dark putty. I bought one of this box. This came up 29 cents. And they also had it in red, but I really liked the pink. So I got that. And the last item, I bought three of these. And these were up with the stationery and all that. Um, retailed for $5. I paid 50 cents for 600 stickers. And I bought three of these. Three. Okay, now that is everything that I bought at my Target. So I'm hoping you are able to score some goodies. Like I said, if you follow me on Instagram, um, here on YouTube, I try to keep you posted as much as possible um, what I find and try to get the video up as soon as possible. 
Uh, sometimes it's a couple of days later, but just keep an eye out on YouTube or Instagram to even for other channels and see if they're hauling it. That goes for the Michaels grab bags. I know a lot of you come to me to ask when they're doing them. I do not know when they do them. I'm just trying to guess on about what time of year they do it, how often they do it after they do it after every season, and every holiday. So the next wrap around would be, I think, St. Patty's Day. So they'll have St. Patty's um, grab bags and then they'll do Easter. And then from there, they have 4th of July. And then from there, they have like the summer and spring items. And then they do the fall and then they do the Christmas. So um, always keep an eye out at, well, uh, I, I've noticed at Michael's, it stays at about 80% for about two weeks. And then after that, they throw everything in bags. Um, if you're not familiar with those, um, go ahead and go to my playlist, click on Michael's grab bags, click on that, and you'll see all the videos I've done with the grab bags. I did not buy any this time around um, after Christmas because I did not need any more Christmas stuff because I got enough from Target. So, as always, I want to say thank you for always taking the time out of your day to sit and watch my videos. So, if you enjoyed, I would love a thumbs up. I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Keep smiling. Bye. Okay, you guys, I found these room essential heart pillows. These things are ginormous. Look at that. They have the leopard and they have red and this taupe. 25 bucks clearance.